When you think about billionaires, your mind probably wanders to places like Silicon Valley or Dubai. Well, you might find this news shocking, but the African continent is actually rising up the ranks rather quickly. The continent has been experiencing an exponential economic boom, and billionaires are popping up left and right. As of 2021, there are about 18 billionaires in Africa. And with a lot of money comes excessive spending. Join us as we take a deep dive into what it is exactly like having billions of dollars in one of the world's poorest continents. Number six, Abdul Samad Rabiu. Abdul Samad Rabiu is a Nigerian entrepreneur. He ended 2021 as Africa's sixth richest person. He has a five and a half billion dollar net worth. Rabiu is the founder of BUA Group, a Nigerian corporation that produces cement, refined sugar, and holds some stake in real estate. Rabiu has an extensive car collection, which consists of a Bentley, an Aston Martin, a $44.9 million Gulfstream G550 with a Rolls-Royce BR710 turbofan engine, and an $18 million Legacy 600 plane. His property in South Africa includes a penthouse at the one and only hotel in Cape Town worth $12.6 million. He also has more property investments in South Africa worth around $19 million, and several homes in Manhattan, New York City, ranging from Eaton Square to Avenue Road, also known as Millionaire's Row. In April 2018, it was reported that Rabiu bought some property on Banana Island, which has some of the highest property rates in all of Lagos, Nigeria. But despite all his wealth, Samad has not turned his back away from his community. He puts his wealth to good work with his philanthropic efforts. Rabiu established the BUA Foundation to support his humanitarian efforts. This includes the development of an $18 billion, 220-bed specialist hospital and the Center for Islamic Studies at Bayero University in the city of Kano. Number five, Johan Rupert. Johan Peter Rupert is a South African-born entrepreneur and the eldest son of business magnate Anton Rupert and his wife, Huberta Rupert. He's the chairman of Richemont, a Swiss luxury watch company, and Remgro, which is a South African corporation. He sits in as the fifth wealthiest person in Africa on the Forbes list of the world's billionaires of 2021, with his fortunes reported being somewhere around $5.4 billion. Out of all the billionaires on this list, Johan probably has the most insane car collection. He doesn't just own a few expensive cars, he owns the Franschhoek Car Museum. The Motor Museum is full of his antique collections, which consist of over 200 vintage vehicles. Some of the most notable additions to his collection are his 63 Ferrari Lusso GT, a Porsche Cayenne, and a Rolls Royce. Number four, Mike Adenuga. Starting from humble beginnings, Mike Adenuga first became a millionaire at the age of 26 by selling lace and soft drinks. Now, he's one of Africa's fastest growing billionaires. His net worth has skyrocketed from $4.6 billion in 2012 to a whopping $6.5 billion towards the end of 2021. All of Adenuga's wealth comes from his massive success in the oil and telecommunications industry. Not only is Adenuga the second richest person in Nigeria, he's also the fourth richest person on the African continent. Mike Adenuga's estate on Banana Island looks like something that dropped down straight from heaven. Some people call Adenuga's mansion the Gold Digger's Den. Adenuga's estate covers a total area of three hectares and comes equipped with all the state-of-the-house technology, making his house fully automated. From lights to doors, everything can be controlled with a tablet. His multi-million dollar car collection consists of a Bentley Continental GT, a Mercedes AMG G63, and a Rolls Royce. Adenuga also owns a private jet, because why wouldn't he? Number three, Nicky Oppenheimer. Nicky Oppenheimer is a South African businessman. He's the chairman of the De Beers Diamond Mining Company, and the only heir to the Oppenheimer family fortune, which is worth around $8.7 billion. Nikki is Africa's third richest man, with a total net worth of $7.7 .7 billion. Most of his fortune comes from his family's diamond business, which has been up and running for over 85 years. Nikki Oppenheimer also owns Zawalu Kalahari Reserve, one of South Africa's largest private game reserves. Oppenheimer has been married to his lovely spouse, Aurelia Lash Oppenheimer, 
who's the daughter of industrial tycoon Heli Lash since 1968. They have a son together named Jonathan Oppenheimer. He currently lives with Aurelia in their multi-million dollar residence in Johannesburg, and owns a country estate in Berkshire, England. Nikki Oppenheimer's car collection includes a Mercedes-Benz McLaren, which costs about $3 million. He also has a $50,000 BMW i3 EV sitting in his garage. The great thing about Nikki is that he's devoted a big chunk of his wealth towards community causes. Much of Oppenheimer's philanthropic efforts have gone towards conserving South African heritage. Number two, Nasef Sawirez. The Sawiris are Egypt's richest family. The family is involved in a variety of business ventures across the country. Nasef Sawiris is an Egyptian businessman. He owns 30% of OCI, which is a fertilizer manufacturer situated in Galeen, Netherlands, which was founded by a merger of his family's business. He sits in with a net worth of around $9.2 billion. Sawiris is married to his wife Shireen, and the couple has four children together. He lives with his family in London. It's generally believed that he owns several multi-million dollar homes in London, Egypt, and New York. Nasef likes to travel with style in his 2019 Audi Q5, which costs upwards of $50,000, depending on the modifications. And being one of the richest people on the planet, Suarez sure wasn't shy with his upgrades. His Audi boasts a high-end luxury interior with wide, well-padded seats, and a modern, user-friendly entertainment system. And number one, Aliko Dangote. Aliko Dangote is a Nigerian entrepreneur and philanthropist. With an estimated net worth of 13.5 billion US dollars, he is Africa's wealthiest individual. Aliko Dangote has been voted as Africa's richest man for the nine consecutive years as of 2021. His company, Dangote Group, which Aliko started more than three decades ago, is one of Nigeria's largest private sector employers and the most valuable company in West Africa. All rich people value their time just as much as their money. Aliko Dangote is no different. And when you have a business to run, traveling is a necessity. Traveling with Nigeria's commercial airliners, even in business class, can be problematic, with frequent delays and rerouting causing an inconvenience for everyone, especially for those who think time is money. This is why Dangote owns a private jet. On the celebration of Aliko Dangote's 53rd birthday, he purchased a private plane called Bombardier's Global Express XRS from Montreal, Canada. If you think having his own private jet is a big deal, wait until you hear what Aliko has sitting in his garage. For a man with Aliko Dangote's wealth, one would expect nothing less than fancy and exotic cars. And Aliko doesn't disappoint. Among his car collection is a Maybach 57S Night Luxury, which costs between $1 and $1.5 million, depending on the upgrades. He also owns a Mercedes-Benz CL65 AMG, a Bugatti Veyron, and a Bentley Mulsanne. All in all, his complete car collection costs somewhere around $500 million US dollars. That's a wrap for this video. Which entry on this list leaves your jaw on the floor? Let us know in the comments below. Make sure to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more videos like this. See you in the next one.